Just like these, there's different mixtures of colors. I can't really name all of them, but I know there's tons of uh, different colorways. Uh, I ended up deciding that I wanted these. Uh, just the colorway was really nice. The gold uh, with the black and white, it looked pretty nice and unique. So I got these. Um, retail price of the shoe is $145 Canadian. Um, for those who live in the United States, I believe it's uh, 120 if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going to get into the details uh, of this shoe. Mainly, um, the first look, obviously, you'll see the logo over here at the tongue. It says Air Hirachi by Nike. At the back, you will see Nike. And down here, you will see Air written on them. Um, this little description of the shoe here, a little um, design here. It's these little kind of bubbles on the bottom heel. On the sides, you'll see this little lines going through. These shoes were designed by Tinker Hatfield. Most of you who don't know who Tinker Hatfield is, uh, he's an American uh, Nike designer. He did design a lot of Air Jordans as well as uh, Nike Air Maxes, and of course these Nike Air Hirachis. Um, so that's just a fun fact that you can learn from this uh, video that Tinker Hatfield is the designer for these shoes. Um, Speaking of sizing, these shoes now, obviously as you see in the box, these are 9.5, however they fit really snug and uh, I might exchange them for a size higher, uh, at least a size 10 or even 10 and a half, I would say just go one size up because these do fit really snug and tight. So I'm going to get into the uh, depth with these shoes now. Um, here as you can see, um, around here, this material, you see kind of rubber type of material. Um, this is a neoprene material designed for comfort and uh, conforming of the foot and ankle. And this is all around the shoe. Um, the midsole is a phylon foam, another factor for comfort. These shoes do have air solid units uh, in the forefoot as well as the heel. Once again, another factor for comfort. Um, so yeah, these shoes are all around very comfortable shoes and I'm sure people that do have them in different colorways uh, could vouch for that and you know uh, support that fact. Um, the reason I wanted to really review these shoes and have them on my channel is because uh, before buying these I tried to look up uh, these shoes and see how they would actually look on foot but I was uh, unable to find anyone that kind of reviewed these shoes. So I kind of, you know, uh, thought why not, I'm just going to end up reviewing them. So here I am with these shoes. Um, yeah, uh, the bottom outer sole is, uh, if I didn't mention, is rubber for durability and grip. And uh, yeah, like I mentioned earlier, these are running shoes. That's what they were designed for and uh, the reason why they're so comfortable and durable is because of that reason. Uh, these shoes do not come in any other laces, but the shoes that you know uh, that come with the laces. So these came in gold laces. Now, if I didn't want to change them up, I could put in black laces. But I think that uh, the laces that these shoes actually come in are the best suited, uh, you know, kind of uh, best suitable for the shoe that you actually bought. So I would just leave them on with just the type of shoe laces that they came with. Unless you want to mix it up, that's up to you. Um, yeah, that's about it. I'm going to give you guys a, a, a on-foot review of these shoes so you can see how they actually look. Maybe with an angle of my whole uh, body so you can see actually how they look from far, up close, and uh, front, back, and everything. 
So stay tuned. I'm definitely gonna um, keep reviewing some more shoes if I do end up getting more shoes. But um, uh, yeah, I haven't done any you know hype uh, kicks or anything like that yet. But I am thinking about it, and I might uh, review some pretty uh, famous sneakers going forward. So stay tuned for that. For now, um, like I said, the reason why I reviewed these is because I, I couldn't see them on uh, anywhere on the internet. Uh, before buying these so stay tuned. I'm gonna definitely put these on feet and uh, Keep you guys updated um, Before I leave I do want to um, you know uh, mention to everyone during this pandemic and this whole COVID-19 thing going around I'm just hoping that you guys are all safe uh, Your families are safe and everyone's doing good um, When you guys do go out wear your masks, um, you know keep yourself safe and uh, protect your little kids your you know children and your um, parents, your grandfather, and grandma, and uh, yeah, I'm wishing you guys all the best, and uh, stay tuned. The trauma, we raised by our mamas, Lord, we got a heal, we hurting our sisters, the babies as well, we killing our brothers, they poison the well, destroy the self-image, we set it to fail, I'ma make sure that the real gon' prevail, nigga. I just poured something in my cup, I been wanting something I can feel, promise I am never letting up. Money in your car will make you rip Put it is on a neck, I got them stuck I'ma give them something they can feel Feeling ain't about to swat, don't give a fuck Pistol in your hand will make you rip